Well, after uh, cutting a heck of a lot of bananas, and I actually filled three trays. One tray was done with lemon water, and uh, I had extra strawberries. So we're going to do this today, which will be done tomorrow. So uh, it'll be interesting what the bananas taste like, the ones with the lemon and one that didn't get lemon. Everything I've seen is both of them work fine. So I'm kind of worried that maybe the ones with the lemon might get more sugary coated looking, but we'll see. But I'm going to load these up. I got my uh, bananas and strawberries all loaded up. Uh, they'll be done probably around dinner time tomorrow. The other thing that was going on today is my electrician's back. I put my 50 amp plug in. So I thought I'd go take a look and see what it looks like. So this is where my plug is going to go. And he just got done stringing a 10 gauge wire from there all the way across there over to there and uh, I believe he's tied it into the circuit breaker and put a new circuit breaker in. So shortly we're going to have a, a new plug here for the fifth wheel over here and that's going to be really cool. Um, the problem I've had in the future past is I've got this trailer plugged into a little plug in the back there which is also sharing my freezer and all it would take is turning on too many things in the RV and <laughs> blow a fuse and if you don't know that happened you also lose all your your meat in the freezer that not would that be cool one last thing I was going to show you today is also uh, before I go get eggs is uh, got all those banana peels and stuff we put this right here by the sink so we're always putting our scraps in it and this is coffee that comes out of these uh, Keurigs so I keep all those take a little knife and I cut them open and dump them out so I at least I have coffee to put into my compost bin so I'm going to take these out to the compost bin and go get eggs Yeah, I know it looks kind of grody, but hey, it's compost, people. And uh, that stuff will be precious. So uh, next thing I got to do is grab some eggs. And we'll see how the uh, girls did today. It's a pretty nice day today. Pretty pretty warm for, for March. So uh, let's see what we do. So it looks like we got three eggs here and a chicken. Two eggs there and one, six, seven eggs there. Wow, so it looks like we did pretty good. So let me get these uh, loaded in my little Easter basket and we'll take them to the house. Well, it looks like I got 11 eggs. So uh, I must have only got nine yesterday. But uh, yeah, I think I need a lot of eggs. So uh, that's why we bought the freeze dryer. So the last thing I got to do is I got to turn on the water and uh, give them uh, more water and feed them like normal. And uh, I try to pet them and touch them and get them used to people. But yeah, I gotta get their food taken care of and put the eggs away. Because of freezing, turning on the water is kind of a pain in the ass. From the pump house here, um, our main valve to the water to the garage is right here. Sorry about the camera. Oh. Step two is to turn it on over here and I'll have water. All right guys, that kind of wraps up all the chores and getting the freeze dryer going, all that. It's very exciting. Uh, this weekend, once again, I hope we'll get the plastic on the greenhouse. Uh, we got starters going in the house. Getting my electrical finished up today. Yay. And uh, the other thing I wanted to talk to you about is uh, I commented the other day, and I didn't mean to rile anybody up, but uh, in a Facebook post that comes across my feed, there's, like, uh, there's a quote like, oh, I hate it when someone doesn't spell something right or doesn't say something right or downplays themselves or whatever uh, on the comments. And uh, I want to make sure you know clearly on this channel, first of all, I'm a redneck. I have terrible grammar. I hate writing long stories. Um, it's reality. 
and I know there's a lot of folks who are on a hurry and they're all worried. Don't worry if you want to leave a comment and you're worried about your wording or uh, stuff. I don't jump to conclusions. If I can make out what you're what you're trying to write to me, I'm happy. And if it's negative too, I'm still going to say thank you for the comment. Uh, so anyway, my my message to you is uh, when you're commenting on our posts and on our Facebook and stuff, we're glad to hear from you. And I don't care if you're using crayons uh, to talk to us. It's it's it's. Uh, everybody's got their different levels of things. Some people aren't very good typers. I hate typing on my phone because my fingers are so fat. And uh, it's just human nature. So I am not going to judge you. <laughs> and nor should you know you worry about anybody else judging you. This isn't a channel for that. We just try to show you what this lifestyle is like. Try to give you some ideas. Give you the realities. It's a lot of work. But there's a lot of beautifulness to it. I mean, look what I got behind me. And uh, anyway, I wish everybody happiness. Uh, I hope everybody, uh, I hope we inspire folks. And uh, you can do it at all ages. No, I'm not one of them young f folks that are, uh, you know, uh, <laughs> working virtual and all that stuff. Um, but I, the point is, anybody can do it at every age, and we can learn from all age brackets. I always notice the youngins don't like to be told anything. Um, but they'll watch videos and stuff and act like nobody's telling them anything but they're learning and uh you know don't be afraid to ask don't be afraid to give us advice and uh don't for, uh, don't forget to buy one of our hats these are the new keep on rednecking hats you can get on amazon if you go in the description below you can uh, get them on amazon they're cool little hats they're called dad hats and they're very comfy and uh i don't like the real tall ones i think i've told you that before but yeah uh, anyway so we got that kind of stuff and of course don't forget about our ranger rob poopy bags that's the best way to support our channel uh besides sharing and liking our pages uh we that really really helps uh, makes uh youtube really happy and of course uh, we have a new link on our youtube channel where you can buy us coffee or we have a paypal link for donations uh in the description uh if you care to do so just helps the channel uh, a lot of this stuff, I mean, like radio station, all that stuff, um, it doesn't seem like it costs money, but we have to pay for all those platforms and licenses and stuff. And, um, and uh, we're always buying new equipment. And plus, size, I just spent $4,000 on a freeze dryer, and I got to pay for that electrician over there. So, anyway, guys, have a great day. Thank you for watching. Please leave a comment below. And, like I said, I don't care if you write in Hebrew, just please leave a comment. We appreciate it. Anyway, guys, have a great day. Love you, and thanks for watching. Bye now. Our videos are made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags, available at Amazon right now. Thank you very much for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. Thanks.